Who was Joseph Godfrey? Joseph Godfrey, or Otako, was born at Mendota in 1835. The son of a French-Canadian voyager and an enslaved black woman named Courtney, Godfrey grew up in the family of Alexis Bailey, a mixed-blood fur trader. In 1857, he married a Dakota woman and moved to the Lower Sioux Agency. At the time of the U.S.-Dakota War, Godfrey was out mowing hay. He was approached by an armed Dakota warrior who told him that he must change his clothes and put on a breechcloth. Afraid that he might be killed, Godfrey put on the traditional Dakota clothing and reluctantly joined the Dakota warriors. Godfrey was the first man to be tried by the military commission following the war. His trial was extensive and included several witnesses, none of which, however, could admit to having seen Godfrey kill anyone. Despite this, Godfrey was sentenced to death by hanging. But Godfrey remained in the courtroom acting as a witness in 55 cases. Godfrey's recollection was remarkable, leading court reporter Isaac V. D. Hurd to comment that Godfrey was specifically designed as an instrument of justice. For his service throughout the Dakota trials, Godfrey's sentence was commuted from execution to 10 years imprisonment. Godfrey was pardoned in 1866 and he moved to the Santee Reservation in Nebraska, where he died in 1909.